Eric Long. Major, how big was it for the team tonight just to get the tournament started the right way and not start the postseason with a loss? Yeah, I think it was really big for us. Um, obviously, from here on out, it's just kind of it's just winning in advance, and we're just glad to come out of there with a win. Andrew Kaufman. Drew, what's it like as a player to consist consistently kind of go through these these close games, especially when you guys have these leads and then you know they start twi dwindling down a little bit, but you, tonight you're able to pull it out. Uh, yeah, I mean it it does get a little tiring, but I mean. If that's what, whatever we have to do to win games, that's what we have to do. Um, there's going to be runs. Teams are going to make runs. We're going to, it's going to kind of go back and forth most of the time. So, I mean, just understanding that we have to, I mean, we just have to have one more point at the end. So, I mean, at the end of the day, that's what we did. Colin. Yeah, Drew, what, what was Coach Martin's message to you guys in that timeout that you took with about a minute left just, just to how to close out the game? Yeah, we just, I mean, we just had to get a stop. Um, I think we were up three at that point, maybe. Um, I'm not sure, but I think we were up three and I know we were making sure we didn't want to give up a three, obviously, um, but just that we needed, we had to lock in one defensive possession. Um, that that was really it. We just had to get stops. Dave Matter. You had about four shots rim out in the first half. Did, did, did it take a while for guys just to settle in offensively? I mean, both teams maybe, but did you just feel better in that second half then? Uh, I mean, yeah, I felt better. I mean, I felt like I was – honestly, I felt like I was taking good shots. They just – they were rattling and rattling out. I was missing layups. It was it was ugly for me there in the first half. Um, but, yeah, I mean, I think just settling in, I think as a team we were able to settle in there in the second half and um, just uh, play a little bit better basketball. Ben Arnett. Drew, what's the feeling like for you? I mean, a year ago this opportunity doesn't happen. Now this is what you came here for. You're in the postseason. You're in the middle of it. What's the feeling like now? Uh, I mean, I think it's, I'm, I'm just excited. I'm excited to have this opportunity. Um, excited to be moving on and just looking forward to, to our next matchup tomorrow. Mitchell? Drew, you all were able to score the ball pretty pretty effectively for most of the second half until about the last six minutes or so. I guess just what, what was the difference in your mind between when the offense was clicking and, and when it wasn't tonight? Um, I mean, I think it was, they, they went to a zone there for a second that I thought um, – I thought it threw us off a little bit. Um, it made us it made us a little stagnant, and we've had that problem in the past. But I think that they went to that two three there for a second, and I think that was right around the time, honestly, whenever that you're talking about. I think it just made us it just gave us a little pause, and um, we weren't as aggressive as we as we had been before. Joel, hey Drew, uh, what do you feel like the difference was for you uh, from between the first half and the second half, or I mean, you shot two for nine in the first. Half and then the second half, it looked like you couldn't miss. Was it the, was it the rim, maybe? What, what was it? <laughs> no, I don't think it was the rim. I mean, I, I guess it was just me. I don't know. I just couldn't make a shot in the first half. I was getting a little frustrated, but I just got, I mean, I just kept telling myself, just just move on, just next play. Um, it'll, shots will start eventually falling. Mason. Hey, Drew. So, how did that solid ending to the first half where you made? you know, over 50% of your shots that culminated in X's buzzer beater. How did that sort of feed into the second half where you were better on the offensive end? Yeah, I thought it gave us a, a definitely a good little burst of momentum there. Um, Kobe got that steal and was able to push it ahead and hit X wide open on, and running on the wing, and he knocked it down. So definitely was big for us to just, I mean, obviously just cut the lead down a little bit. We were able to come out only down one. And just also to get our momentum, get our spirits up and everything going into that second half. Dave Matter. Okay, Mitch. Yeah, Drew, you all turned 13 turnovers into 19 points. I guess just how important was it to be able to not only get those turnovers, but but capitalize and transition? Yeah, it was definitely important. It's always for, important for us to get out and run in transition, I think. And live ball turnovers are usually the easiest way to do it. So um, it's definitely good that we were able to capitalize on those. And um, hopefully we can continue that. Eric? Drew, you keep mentioning just how close these games have been recently, you know, and it's not too long ago you had that shot against Florida. Just is there a certain way the team envisions those close game scenarios going, or is there a certain person you want taking that last, uh, last second shot or anything like that? I mean, I think we have a lot of guys that are confident to have the ball in their hands at any time in the game. So, I mean, just just trying to make sure that we're still – we're not – we're taking team shots. So that was something that we said there late down the stretch. We're making we're making the one more pass still. We're not trying to take any hero type shots. So just making sure that we're still playing good basketball no matter how much time is left on the clock. Okay. 
Thanks, Jim. Thanks, guys. Questions for Kobe?